I don't think it's a factor at all. I think the only okay. gendered thing I notice about it yeah. is the way that everyone who writes a story about the company has to talk about her turtleneck and the fact that she wears black. Yes. Like, the obsession with her clothing is very strange and her look. I don't think we'd talk the same way but, about sort of a charlatan male founder. Gotcha. Um, I I don't think it has a big impact. I, I personally, uh, I think that argument is... Um, flawed. I don't I know. Yeah. This is actually one of the rare cases where it is not a factor. I do yeah. think that it was a factor in to some extent in the fawning before. Got it. Yes. Not so, necessarily her gender, but the fact that here's this young, attractive woman who's really photogenic and I mean I think people wanted to boost her in a way. Well, in the same way that again the Hampton Creek guy, I don't know if you've ever met him, but he was like a hunky guy. Strapping, totally. Yeah, I've had him on the stage. Football player yeah. from like Alabama, Alabama yeah. whatever. Makes for a good cover. I, exactly. Yes. If they're and good if you're TV, Inc. or entrepreneur or fast company, you need somebody good looking on the cover. Exactly. And I don't think it's gendered, I think it's right. just like attractiveness. Charis- like charisma is charisma. Sure. Mm-hmm. Like someone who is charismatic is is going to get somewhere in this world. But yeah. I don't think it's going to lead to, it is certainly not going to lead to a backlash against female founders or anything no. like that. I mean, I think, it, if anything, it's great, right? Because we'll never be truly equal when we, unless we are able to be as corrupt and useless and, and fail I as hard as a man. Really- Wistia is an amazing product. I use it here at This Week in Startups. You know, when you do uh, YouTube videos on your personal website or your business's website, you know what happens? At the end, they see Gangnam Style in your competitors' videos, and then they get pulled off. And everything is about YouTube. You know what? When you use Wistia, you control the entire video experience, including maybe asking people for an email if they want to join your mailing list and showing them the videos that you want to show them. And you have the metrics, not Google. You want to have your own private, protected software as a service, video product for your own website. You don't want to just dump your videos on YouTube. Sure, YouTube's great, other services are great, Vimeo, whatever. You want to have a professional service that you can control on your website. It's critical, and that's why I use Wistia. Who else uses it? MailChimp, Moz, HubSpot, Zendesk, Herman Miller, Sam Adams, everybody. And they are another one of these companies that's been with us for years. Um, I started actually as a client, and then they started advertising because they kept talking about how great it is. 220,000 customers uh, at the start of 2016. Um, and when they sponsored us like two years ago, whatever, or a year ago even, it was like 50,000 people. So they are growing gangbusters. Uh, and in no small part to all of you as fans of the show, thanking Wistia on your Twitter account, amazing analytics, trends, viewer streams, and you can capture these email addresses before and after a video plays. The other services like YouTube will never let you do that because all they care about is getting the users themselves and capturing the users themselves. I get hundreds of emails a month, actually thousands of emails a month of our own subscribers, which then lets me promote other things we're doing and invite you to events. Super critical to get that direct relationship. Super easy to use, lots of supports and new tools and features built specifically for marketers. Tons of resources to help you get off the ground. They have a great like content marketing team over there because they do all these videos on how to use microphones and lighting, all this stuff, um, and how to do it uh, on, a, on a nickel. So if you're going to do a podcast or a video show, go over there and just read their content. It's amazing. Start your two-week trial for free. Wistia.com slash twist. Wistia.com slash twist. Of course, their confidence and no credit card is required. That's what I always look for with uh, one of our partners is do they require a credit card? In this case, no, because they know you're going to love it. And you can upload as many videos as you like. I love Wistia. I give them my highest recommendation. And uh, I would love to invest in them.